Our top story this afternoon, a state commission has announced the results of its public survey over the fate of two nuclear reactors that were being built near Ulsan in the southeast of the country. The reactor's construction had previously been suspended by the Moon administration. For more, we have our Jim Myung-gil on the line for us. So, myung -gil, just walk us through the results of this survey. Right, Mark. I'm at the government complex in Seoul right now, and just two hours ago, the chairman of the state commission, Kim ji hong announced the results, saying nearly 60% of the public favored continuing the construction of the two unfinished nuclear reactors, while 40% called for abandoning the construction. Currently, the two reactors are about 30 percent complete. Now, the commission also stated that although the public were in favor of restarting the construction, when it comes to future policy, over 50 percent of the participants advised the government to opt for cleaner sources of energy. Now, back in June, the government suspended the reactor's construction and then established the independent commission in charge of collecting views from the public. Since August, the commission formed a jury and provided them with information on the merits and downsides of the project. The 471 jury members spent four days together debating the issue over the past weekend, during which they heard from experts representing both sides. Now, after that, the commission conducted a final survey of the jury and, based on its results, drew up its recommendation to the government. So the state commission has announced its results, which you just took us through. Now, mm -hmm. these results are going to be passed over to President Moon Jae-in for his uh, final decision, right? Yes, that's absolutely right, Bark. And President Moon will make a final decision during the cabinet meeting on October 24th on whether to restart or permanently halt the construction of the Shingori 5 and 6 nuclear reactors. Now, it is likely that President Moon will respect the commission's decision and give the green light to restart the construction of the two nuclear reactors. It goes counter to President Moon's pledge during his campaign period, as he had said he would halt the construction of any nuclear reactors. Now, some four million U.S. dollars was spent running this special commission, and over one billion dollars has been spent on the Shingori 5 and 6 nuclear reactor construction project. But the results of the commission could still be seen as in line with President Moon's energy policy, as the Moon administration wants to phase out Korea's reliance on nuclear energy in the long term. Back to you, Mark.